We're looking at using ACA manual J parameters. Remember to use the manufacturer's correction tables to adjust for your specific conditions. Don't oversize load capacity more than 15% of the total calculated load. Never rely on ARI data for precise equipment selection. And don't guess. It's in the lottery and you don't plan on putting up your business as collateral. All houses are of the same square footage are not created equal, so the 400 or 500 square foot per ton rule doesn't work. Glass can account for 25 to 50 percent of the total load. Look out for super high efficiency windows. Uh, they can significantly reduce the calculated load, and if you're getting into something like that, you are going to need the, the J8 version on manual J to do the calculations. Uh, so our formula, ACA J8 calculation, up-to-date ARI, ARI reference data, manufacturer's performance data with correction factors for manual J conditions, plus proper duct design, proper duct installation, proper selection of grills, thermal integrity at home equals a comfortable, satisfied customers. Customers getting what they paid for. Questions? Okay. Then the part I know y'all really came to see. Contractor's law, law and rules. Uh, if you go on the website, there's two or three ways you can get on there. If you go on just open websites, you can click on there. Then you can click right here on air conditioning refrigeration. It'll take you over here. Uh, you got you want to renew your license? You got new license applications or a license renewal for certified AC tech, registered AC tech. Anything you want for your last renewal there. Uh, and if you're like me, uh, the nice thing about renewing your license online is it's quick and it's fast. I kept putting it off, putting it off, and I looked up one day and thought, oh, crap. I looked up and my license needed to be renewed that day. <laughs> Oh, so I went back down, set on my computer real quick, and got it done in, you know, maybe 10 minutes. Uh, so it's fast and it's easy. Uh, and relatively painless. Uh, if you see a, an unfamiliar service truck running around that has a name on the door but no license, uh, and you want to see if it's legal, you can click here and search for license regulation or registration. You go to this deal here, uh, fill in whatever information you saw, what you know, and do a search, and it'll pull up anything close to that.